Hello everyone. Let us see how we can use some date functions within Power Query. Now the best part here is that you don't even need to learn any functions. Most of these options are available in the click of a button. For example, if I have the order date and I would like to find out the day of the week, whether it's a Monday or Tuesday or Wednesday, etc. Then there are two options. If you go to transform and then we click on date, this will overwrite the order date. For example, if I select day and the name of the day, it will. Let me do it one more time. So day and then the name of the day, you notice it overwrites it. Let me delete the last step. If you want to retain the original order date column and you want to create a new one, then we can go to add column and we do the same thing date and then we say day and then we say the name of day. And now you notice at the very end, we also have the day name. Let's call this the weekday. The function is also very simple. It simply says table dot add column. We created a column called day name and the function is called date dot day of weekday. But like I said, the best part is you don't have to learn all these things since you just have to use the click of a button. And if you see the other options that are available here, there are quite a few options. So we have the age, the date, the year, start of year, end of year, then some month options, quarter, week, and day options as well. 